Kemal Davish, you are a former Minister of the Economic Affairs in Turkey, now a senior academic at the Brookings Institution. A simple question, are we in a permanent low interest environment and if so, what does it mean? There are two main reasons I think for the, interest, for the low interest rates. One is monetary policy of course of the big central banks trying to bring the recovery about, strengthen it. But there's another one which is chronic lack of investment compared to desired savings. Despite very high profits in the corporate world and of course despite the low interest rates themselves. These interest rates are anomalous. At the end of the day, financial sector interest rate and real returns on capital don't equalize rapidly, but an interest rate exists because there is a return on real investment uh, that needs to be financed, intermediated. So this gap between the real return on capital and it, the monetary interest rate will not last forever. But because of the underlying weakness of the world recovery, I think we, we are not, and of course the low inflation, we are not looking to a rapid rise, certainly not in the next, I would say, two, three years. Mm -hmm. And does that mean there will be a difference between the United States on the one hand and Europe on the other hand? Because one thinks that perhaps there will be a rate raise, rise quite soon in the States, but one can't see it happening in Europe at the moment. There may well be a rate rise in the States, but it will be very small. It's, I think, already priced in to expectations. So I, do, I think whatever divergence uh, you know, one could expect because of it has already happened in a way. The dollar has strengthened and, and so on. What about the WPC? I mean, you, you come here each year, I think. And what do you find is useful about the World Policy Conference? They choose the, int the topics I think in a very intelligent way, in a very appropriate way. There is real substance, but there is also friendship that evolves over the years. And I like the size. Yes. It is not a very small conference, but it's not a huge one. So one gets to discuss things in some depth, not just during the sessions, but also during social moments. And I actually li like the fact that it lasts two and a half, almost three days. Again, one finds the time to enter into some depth. A lot of panels and conferences are squeezed so much in time that you know one goes for sound bites. There is more scope here for real discussion. Kamal Davish, thank you so much for being thank with you, us. Thank you, John.